Well, hey there, folks, and uh, welcome back, I guess. Now, normally when we do a, a sauce-heavy episode, we poke holes in the sausage and we watch all the sauce drain out in the pan. Today's going to be different, though, because I bought a smoker, and we're going to smoke this Tabasco sausage. We're going to smoke this Tabasco sausage for two hours. But of course, we're starting with our classic base of, of pork butt. And then we're just going to put way too much sauce into it. We're putting our meat in the grinder first, and then we're going to cover it in the most delicious of sauces. Which is actually not true. Uh, Sweet Baby Ray's is, is a more delicious uh, sauce than Tabasco, and you can put that on my headstone. Wait, should I have used Sweet Baby Ray's for this instead of Tabasco? That probably would have made more sense. A, a barbecue sauce for smoked sausage probably would have made more sense. But we already did a Sweet Baby Ray sausage, so, you know, that's that's the end of that. You know who would love to see this? Mrs. Sausage. Hey, Mrs. Sausage, you want to come down here and see this? No. All right, moving on then. And there's our beautiful ground sausage, or innards, it's not quite a sausage yet, until we add salt and 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 plenty plenty of black pepper this is this is going on the smoker so so more black peppers uh good and then of course we put the the uh to oh man this is gonna take forever we want this to uh to really have that tabasco flavor in it it smells a little spicy in here Smells a lot spicy. I'm gonna sneeze. <laughs> oh, that's gonna sting. Now that's a spicy a meatball. And just a little bit more. I'm gonna save some of this for the kids' ice cream. Zero calories. Not bad. It's a healthy choice. I've seen fire and I've seen sausage. Eh, that one's not very good. But with the sausage might be better. That's a, that's a lot of Tabasco water. Where is this water coming from? Oh my God, oh my God. Little unintended consequences right there. In three, two, one. Let's sausage. There's some, there's some, there's some. This is a liquid that's not wanting to come out peacefully. It, it's almost as if the sausage is being cooked by the Tabasco sauce. Well, I guess, I, I guess that's it. That's a that's a disappointing amount to to come out of there. I guess we'll have we'll have enough for for two sausages. These these are some ugly looking sausages. I I don't know. I think Tabasco may have been the wrong ingredient for this. What special thanks to today's Mark Boxelo box artist? There he is down there. He's the, he's the, he's the brown girl. Can you believe the nerve for 11 steps for nachos? Not 10, not a nice round number like 10. We got him, we got him right in the face. How does it feel, you 11 step A pretty below average blow, but we, we did manage to, to knock him out. So I'm gonna have to give that, will it blow? Two more. Ruffalos. Normally we would poke these right about now, but we're gonna we're gonna not do that because they're going in the smoker now. Well, we, 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 we have a bit of a mixed result here. On the one hand, it looks like they have a ball sack. Uh, and on the other hand, they've developed uh, some nice, some nice smoke color. But this is all just, I think, Tabasco and fat drainage. Let's cut the sacks off. I think our sausages were a little too loose. We should have just made like one thick one. We'll do a we'll do a, we'll do a sausage autopsy on on one of these sausages here. We'll cut it. It looks okay. So you know that's what it looks like on the inside. It looks it looks good. We place it in our patented hot dog bun. That's it's a that's a dry looking sausage. Well, all right, here we go. 
I can't break the skin. The, the skin is, is as chewy as chewy can be. I, I can't break it. This is after me trying to gnaw on the skin for, for a good while. It tastes like a Slim Jim and a chorizo, but I cannot break into this skin. I'm, I'm gonna go with Tabasco's a bad idea for sausage. It's basically inedible. You, you can't penetrate that skin once it's in your mouth. The flavor of the meat's good, although it's it's a little loose, as you can see. I, I, there's something weird going on with Tabasco and meat. I think it cooks it like lime-cooked shrimp. So, you know, the sausage is, you know, basically, it's basically, you know, not good. The smoke combined with the Tabasco flavor is great. There's, it's, it's, it's totally a 5 out of 5 flavor combo. The rest of this is is like trash. Flavor wise it's a 5 out of 5. No 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 question there. Texture wise and everything else wise it's a dump. Almost a disqualified level sausage. Just because of how cumbersome it is to eat this thing I have to give this sausage here a 1 out of 5. Bop, 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 bop. You know, when we use the smoker again, we'll use a, an ingredient that's not so gonna ruin the sausage.